Today we will talk about 5 diseases that are caused by lack of sleep. So we hope you watch this video carefully until the end to know everything properly. I think we have all experienced what happens when your body doesn't get enough sleep. Your brain isn't as clear, you feel tired and run down. You get irritated easily, sometimes feel depressed. You are just not your usual self. So, I think it's safe to say that we all realize that not getting enough sleep is not good for our bodies. But what you may not know is that not getting enough sleep on a regular basis can lead to chronic disease. Even sleep deprivation for a short period of time can cause inflammation, impair glucose regulation and increase blood pressure. Below I have listed 5 diseases that can develop due to sleep deprivation, as well as some tips on how to develop good sleeping habits. Number 1. Heart disease. Not getting enough sleep can lead to heart disease such as congestive heart failure, coronary artery disease, heart attack and heart failure. A study of 657 Russian men over a 14-year period found that two-thirds of the men who developed heart disease also had some type of sleep disorder. Number 2. Depression. A study in 2005 of people in the United States found that those people who reported having depression or anxiety also reported getting six or less hours of sleep per night. Findings of a study of 10,000 people in 2007 showed that those who reported having insomnia were five times more likely to report depression as those people who got at least eight hours of sleep per night. Number 3. Prostate cancer and breast cancer. Lack of sleep can also lead to the development of certain cancers, including breast cancer and prostate cancer. A study in hosts who live their circadian rhythm disrupted, such as shift workers, are at an increased risk of developing cancer. A study of 2,000 women between 2005 and 2008 found that the rate of breast cancer was 30% higher in women who worked late shifts, while men who don't get enough sleep are two times more likely to develop prostate cancer. Number 4. Diabetes. Because lack of proper sleep decreases the body's ability to regulate glucose and makes it more insulin resistant, diabetes is more prevalent in those people who don't get enough sleep on a regular basis. When the body is insulin resistant, your body cells aren't able to use insulin effectively which results in high blood sugar and diabetes. Number 5. Obesity. It's estimated that 65% of Americans are overweight or obese. Wow! This is partly due to Americans' love of fast food and junk food and leading a sedentary lifestyle. But, obesity has also been linked to those who don't get enough sleep. Lack of sleep disrupts hormones that control appetite which could lead to people overeating. Sleep deprivation also makes people feel more tired so that they don't feel like exercising. Some things you can do to help you get a better night's sleep are. Number 1. Get plenty of exercise. The more a person moves during the day, the more tired they feel at night. So rather than staying up late, they go to bed early enough to get plenty of sleep. Number 2. Bedroom environment. Your bedroom should be cool at night. Between 60 to 70 degrees Fahrenheit or 16 to 21 degrees Celsius. Also make sure to keep it nice and dark and insulated from noise. Number 3. Relax before bed. Don't engage in exercise right before bed as it causes an increase in energy in your body. Instead, relax with a book or meditate before bed. Number 4. Have a sleep schedule. Most infants and toddlers have a sleep schedule. Why should that change just because you are an adult? Go to bed and wake up at the same time every day even on weekends. In time, you will train your body to fall asleep at a certain time every night so that you get a restful sleep. Hope you find this video helpful, if yes then please hit the like button below. Make sure you subscribe us because we post health benefit related video every single day. If you have a request for a video, be sure to leave it in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Take care, bye.